Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel Code Craft Shop. My name is Selesh Kushwaha and in this course we are going to learn as how to download the setup for code ready containers. We will install OpenShift on laptop in easy steps. Then we will log into the OpenShift cluster via command line. And then in the end we will log into the OpenShift cluster via web console. So there are some prerequisites in order to install OpenShift on laptop. So in order to download the setup you should have a Red Hat account. If you don't have Red Hat account then please use the below link to re register for a Red Hat account. So once you have logged in into Red Hat account, so you have to navigate to this particular link from where we can download the code ready container setup and then don't forget to download the pull secret. So in the demo I will show you each and every step so guys let's get started. So now I am going to log in to the Red Hat account. So after logging into the account, you have to navigate to this particular URL. Then you have to click install OpenShift on laptop. Then you need to click on download code ready containers and then download pill secret. So in order to save time I already have downloaded the setup. So this is the setup. Now I am going to extract it. Now I am going to click on this .msi setup. Then I will click on next. Then I will accept the agreement. I will click on next. And then next. And then I will install. I will click on yes. do the full setup so it is asking me to restart my system I'll click on yes so after restart you will able to see a code ready containers icon over here so I will click on this so I will go to the settings so here we have to paste the pull secret so I will open this pull secret contents I'll copy the contents and then I will navigate to this pull secret and here I will specify the things and I will click on OK. Then I will click on ap apply and I will refresh. So I will close this and I will again click on this tray icon and then I will click on start then we will monitor the logs I will click on code ready containers then I will click on status and logs so here if you can see the logs are you know changed so it is configuring the OpenShift cluster and it is starting the cluster It will take around you know 8 to 9 minutes in order to do the whole processing. Here it is saying that it is extracting the CRC HyperV you know bundle. So we will navigate to the dot CRC folder and where we can see the you know bundle is getting extracted.
so this folder is getting created here it will extract the you know contents of the bundle in the cache folder here we have the you know CRC related informations these are the logs I'll click on the status and logs So here if you can see we are waiting for the QAP API server availability so it is saying that it will take around 2 minutes So here if you can see the users has been added to the cluster we will click on the icon and then we will click on launch web console so now we are into the openshift cl cluster which is running on local laptop we will login into the openshift cluster using command now I will go to the folder where the OC OpenShift command line is extracted so I'll click on CMT CRC so minus minus credentials so once I click on this so it has given me two users one is developer user and one is admin user so we'll log in using the developer so I will copy this command and then I will paste this command click on enter so it is saying that we have already successfully logged into the cluster so these are the two ways to log in into the cluster if you haven't subscribed to my channel then please go ahead and subscribe because it will help you in getting the latest updates whenever I upload thank you guys for watching this video you have been a great audience thanks